G'day guys, how you doing? It's been about three to four weeks since my Celestrol mount has gone back to Celestrol in Australia to work out what was wrong with it. And I thought I'd give you guys a bit of an update as to what's happening. So, it's back. Now, if you remember, I had initially thought that the motorboard uh, was gone on it because nothing was happening at all. Um, but then when you plug the hand controller into a USB port, um, the, the hand controller would uh, would fire up. So, yeah, I thought it was the uh, the motor board, but guess what? It was the hand controller that was gone. Um, turns out that there was a, uh, a burnt out chip in the hand controller, um, which stopped the whole functionality of the uh, of the mount. So, Celestron were pretty uh, Celestron Australia were pretty quick in uh, rectifying the problem and sending it out back to me with a, a new hand controller and they also updated all the firmware so it's all up to date with everything and it works completely fine um, in that I think I'm gonna buy myself a second hand controller now just in case for, for uh, you know the future especially when I go out to, to locations um, it will probably be handy to have a, a spare hand controller unfortunately I can't afford to have a spare mount um, and that would just be way too much more, more gear to carry on me. So I thought I'd make this uh, quick short video to give you guys a bit of an update as to what happened with the CGXL and now that it's back we can get those twin rasters back on it and start shooting the night sky but there are some changes with that too so uh, yeah stay tuned and uh, see what else I've done with my twin raster setup. Well until next time guys take it easy. See you.